Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Katie. Today we're going to be doing a very short video on how to increase your income through a lot of different things. Could be energy work, could be ritual work, could be common sense, a lot of different things that can help you increase your income and your um, financial abilities, your financial worth. So this video is called Health is Wealth. I learned this the hard way. I have to be very honest with you guys. Um, the habits that we place on our daily life can tremendously impact our income. So if we are eating whatever is in the fridge and we're not even paying attention to what is happening as far as nutrition goes, is we, if we are sleeping two hours a night and then 12 hours the next day and it's just irregular in every way, our income will be irregular as well. Um, if we are inconsistent, our income is going to be inconsistent. If we are excellent, determined and disciplined, our income will be excellent. If we are great, above average, fantastic, that's how our income is going to be. If we're lazy, our income is going to be quite lazy too. So our income is somehow a reflection of us and how we are doing things in our life. I have a great friend, Jennifer, who would always say this to me, and I never really understood it until now. The way we do one thing is the way we do everything. So you might think that's not the case because you are putting a lot of energy, let's say, into your work and your career and not enough energy into your relationships. So you might see them as different. But if you really look deep into it, if you're inconsistent, you're going to be inconsistent in everything, not only in your relationships or your career, there's a big chance that the bad habits that you have are going to be reflecting on your income and all areas of your life, truly. So I have finally come to accept <laughs> what I have tried to avoid for so long because I have, I have been able, I have been trying to take shortcuts and to think that all of these things are negotiable. But at the end of the day, I have to say they are not, they are not negotiable for me. If I need, if I want to be in my A game, and if I want to have my highest possible income um, ability, I need to be eating well, I need to be sleeping well, I need to be very hydrated, I need to be taking care of my spiritual and mental health, I need to be working out at least four times a week. <sighs> it's, it's been so hard for me to accept this because I've been trying to manifest high amounts of money without this habit and I've honestly burned out So <laughs> in the past. so. It's something that I have come to uh, the conclusion and I would love to share it with you because I wouldn't like you to go through the same experience that I have in the last three years in which I've been taking a semi care of myself, but not completely. As soon as I shifted this, as soon as I really started taking 100% care of me, my income bloomed almost effortlessly because the energy that we're sustaining is the energy that's going to be reflected on our income. So if you are inconsistent, I'm sorry, my friend, you're going to have to become consistent for your income to become consistent. There's no way around it. We have the power to change it. We tend as humans to look for easy way outs for shortcuts and for ways in which we, we can like hack this truth, but we just have to do what it takes. And if you don't want to do what it takes, maybe that's not what you want to manifest. Maybe that's another result that you really need. So think about what you want, observe why you might feel afraid of what you want. If you are committed to what you want, you'll do what it takes to manifest it. And usually to manifest anything, I think that the commitment to ourselves is the first step. Committing to ourselves first, because otherwise we can set big dreams, big goals that can destroy us in the process. We need to take care of ourselves first and then that manifestation is going to come um, as a consequence, as an effortless consequence of, of being healthy, of being in our center, be feeling wealthy as a human being in our physical body. And that is going to help us in turn manifest that abundance externally as well. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to make this family grow. And you can also check out my website, awakenwildchild.com, in which I have online courses, guided meditations, and exercises of all sorts to assist you with your spiritual journey and manifest your best life yet.